Hello, hello everyone. Welcome to Cure Design. I'm Janine and in today's tutorial I show you how to use a different face, oh yes, different face patches for your facial expression, like angry or maybe more lovely. And in this tutorial I make a shout out of a filter that some of the video guys created with the help of uh, this little tutorial. Please enjoy uh, this uh, filter, you find the link down below and if you make a, a new design uh, with the help of my tutorials please send me a uh, a message uh, so I can shout out your filter it would be an honor for me to do that so please uh, send me a dm via instagram at qdesign or uh, leave me the link down below uh, in this comment so that everyone can use your great filter thank you so much and let's start with the tutorial okay let's start uh, you see i have made some um, backgrounds for the scene that are the three for one for kisses surprise and smile face uh, later in the patch editor but uh, I will show you if you um, never seen a tutorial before uh, with um, person segmentation I show you just quick in this tutorial how you add a person segmentation with an animation sequence start with a canvas right and put a rectangle into this canvas and this yes scale fill width and fill height now we put the new material into our scene. This material material is the angry mat, and add an um, new animation texture into the scene. This is the uh, angry uh, angry animation angry and to my um, and now you need just the segmentation person segmentation go to your material and to alpha uh, put the checkbox on person segmentation mask invert and yellow. I um, put this layers on uh, invisible check out this so um, I do the same with the three other layers right here alpha invert person segmentation and now we just see my last uh, canvas my angry canvas <laughs> uh, angry mat okay and now we start with the patch editor uh, view show patch editor and we need a face tracker So you can add the face tracker in your patch editor right here and now you see we need this link here uh, this menu point or navigate navi navigation point this navigation point uh, interaction and there are so many different um, patches right here for interesting and uh, you know some of them maybe when you see or uh, saw some of my tutorials before this mouse open or this blink is very common uh, to the most um, 
filter on uh, in, in Instagram. So we just use four different uh, face uh, expression patches for our tutorial right now. And uh, this is, uh, you see it maybe uh, right here. Which one could it be? Okay, let's start. We start with um, blah, 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 kissing face. At this patch there. Oh, no, sorry. Then another link for a smile at just another link for a kissing smile surprise. And for our angry face, there is no angry patch. <laughs> But uh, there is, uh, I think it's it's more like the raise uh, eyebrows and lower eyebrows, eyebrows lowered, like, okay, use that. And now you, we need to attach our visibility of our different canvas to I um, select all of them and go to visible and use uh, click this little arrow here and then you have all four patches for our face tracker and so a little bit above, the kiss is here Smile is right here. Surprise! Here. And angry face. Okay, uh, well, I am smiling right now. Not really, but, um, well, it's neat a little bit. But when you make a kiss face and a smile, this one, lower your eyebrows and yeah, the angry one. And of course, surprise! It's a little mix up between a smile and surprise. And you see when maybe we need, we use the other. We use the surprise, not surprise. Wait, wait. I, no. I do this. I mean. Now it's working better. Well, the patch editor or the face tracker, uh, there's a little difference between surprise and smile, I think. So it's uh, like this is the exact same like this one. I have no idea. But uh, yes, it's working. And now I show you just um, for the angry patch, how you can add different layers into your scene. So you can make this whole uh, scene very funny and uh, sparkling and exciting for your different faces. And it's pretty simple. I just make a um, particle system put it right in right here that's um angry part and f uh, add in textures and i have some of this little sweet kittens from my uh i don't know um mobile phone emoji cons or something like that Yes, open, make just, I need to disconnect them for a while, so it's not, and add a new material into uh, this scene, and this is uh, uh, angry, Cat particle and uh, at the angry cat. No, the second one is just this looks not so nice. It's this one. 
this angry uh, little kitten and line a little bit deeper and a little bit whoops no 24 uh, 24 it's 24 <laughs> A birthright, I think it's okay. Maybe a little bit bigger and a little bit longer. Yeah, angry kittens can fly. And maybe not so many. And take. 20 and um, this numbers that I use it could be different for you there's another uh, system or measure system I have no idea but uh, I see some other tutorials and the um, scale is much higher um, well I don't know why it's so different uh, for me or in Germany no idea. So, sweet kittens, angry, angry kittens. Maybe six of them are enough. Great. And I have just another face. Ma no, no, wait. It's yeah, I put it in the face tracker, but it's not a face match. It's just a plane for another graphic. Mm, whoop, right here great and a little bit higher yeah yeah it's okay and new texture okay this one um plain new material pretty fast new material angry mesh i just call it mesh mat i have no idea well and then put this angry hello <laughs> um, a little bit too big and flat i love uh, to be honest i love uh, this uh, comic style this flat style ah, i see a little problem with my particles it's um the the particle yes system uh the mat material advanced render options the death so yeah there's no problem right now and in this the same too because no there's no problem so there's no need for that if a angry mesh is okay and a little bit smaller maybe no. Great, and now uh, we put the lower eyebrows on and of course uh, we need the visibility right here and from this one and put this down below. Hey, ta-da! And it's so simple. You can add so many different layers, patches, so many different scene objects uh, into your scene right here. And uh, just in quick time, um, quick time, or uh, I make the other uh, particles. I just use this particle for the other one and add some details for every um for the different yes styles <laughs>
Okay, and uh, you see there are so many different um, meshes and in this case I make a little blush into the scene. See? And kissing kitties with particle. For smile I just use the particles. Yay! And for surprise I uh, make um, face distortion use a face distortion pack so you see many different uh, um, solutions for us or some inspiration for your next project i hope you enjoyed uh, this little tutorial and when you have questions questions no okay no no questions when you have questions, uh, please send me a comment or leave me a, a message in Instagram at Kino Design. I uh, hope I can help you or uh, you have maybe a lot of fun with this little tutorial or out of this tutorial and own creation and own design. Please send me a message. I want to make a shout, a shout out in my next tutorial for you and yes. See you next time and enjoy the process. Bye bye.